The thing that I know I'm playing well is when I feel like the opponents are playing slow. And it's when I feel like I'm so much faster than everything else and everything is kind of going in slow motion. That's when I feel like I'm playing my highest. It's not only tennis, your mind has to be right, your physique has to be right, your footwork has to be right. So that's uh, where it all starts, I think. But when I feel like you know, everything kind of happens a little slower than it actually does, that's when I feel like at my best. Ah. He's pulled the backhand, he's furious. And the Italians don't like it. It's been at times very difficult, at times I didn't play my best. I feel like I know what my abilities are, I know what I, how I can play, but I am top 10 in the race, I'm number six in the world, so if you look at it that way, it's not all that bad. For a horrible year that everybody's saying you're having, if that's the worst year that I'm gonna have in my career, you know, I'll sign it any day. But still, I obviously wanna do better. So I gotta get my game back, I gotta get my mind back, and I'm still in the race to London, I'm still right up there, and I hope I can make it and continue to build on my performances from the last few weeks, from Labour Cup especially, and uh, we'll see how it goes until the end of the year. Labour Cup was a lot of fun. Clinching it for Team Europe was amazing and what a great atmosphere. Playing alongside other great players was very special to me. You don't only play for yourself, you play for your teammates, you play for a continent, you play for the spectators that come to watch and uh, I think that helped me at the end. It was a very special moment for me. It's more about how to play the game and what they see from the sideline. Zero technique, zero those small things. Uh, I talked to Roger about it, he said he hasn't thought about technique since he's 16 years old. It's how they notice things, how they notice the things that are happening off court. Because at the end of the day, I mean, everybody can hit a great four and everybody can hit a good serve. They see when somebody is frustrated about something quicker than others do, they can use it better. This is something that I think I can learn the most from, from those guys. London is in the back of my mind. I want to qualify, I still want to give my chance to defend my title. Oh, what a way to finish! Yeah, it obviously meant a lot to me to the biggest title of my career so far. Hopefully there will be some other titles there, but it was a great feeling winning against all those great players. I mean, especially beating Roger and then Novak uh, back to back. It's something that a lot of people have done before, so that was an amazing feeling. And this is something, the sport that I love it is something that I grew up watching with my family. I grew up always watching them. There's no other job that I would rather do than being a tennis player. For me right now, it's easy. I'm trying to make London. I'm trying to kind of get to the World to Finals tournament where I have the best memories I can have from last year. So at times, it's obviously very difficult. At times, you rather want to be in the sun on a holiday somewhere. At the end of the day, it's a sport that I love, it's a sport that I enjoy playing and you know, I'm looking forward to, to the rest of the season. Okay,